Hello and welcome back to another GTA 5 video on the channel and this episode is gonna be pretty special because I'll be doing two experiments in one single video. I've also brought back the commentary for this one because some people have been requesting it but I'm not sure what I'm gonna do in the future. I'm also not sure about having commentary in these direct videos but anyways let me know what you think in the comment section down below. I also just want to thank everyone for the incredible support over the past few days. I've got over 200,000 views in the past two days which is absolutely crazy and I'm glad that you've been enjoying my videos lately. Before we actually begin with our experiments we're gonna play a quick little game. There's a list of random GTA characters on the screen with the number next to their names. Like the video and check the last digit of the like number. For an example if you like the video and there are 21 likes you're Franklin because one is the last digit and one corresponds to Franklin. K means a thousand so if the video has more than 1000 likes which I doubt is ever gonna happen you can comment a character of your choice. Like the video now and let me know in the comments down below which character you've got because I'm really interested to see who wins. But now without any further ado let's move on to the experiments. In the first experiment today we'll see what happens if you steal Amanda's car. If you remember correctly in one of my older videos I already tried to destroy it but now we'll try stealing it instead and what do you think will happen let me know in the comment section down below. Okay so we have arrived at Michael's house but as you can see, it seems like Amanda's car is actually not parked here, which is kinda annoying. I guess I'm just gonna have to move away from the house and wait for the car to respawn. Anything? Oh yes! Oh yes, I can see it already. It has spawned in and we are right about here. We're just gonna move his pickup truck out of the way so we can have a quick escape. Okay, so I just stole her car. It was as easy as that. Jimmy's also a witness. Oh, you really are a sad bastard. Yo! You're not that I've actually received a text. I've actually received a text. Michael has just texted me. Oh my god. It says Amanda knows you've got her car and she's on the warpath. Oh my god, that's... Yo, that's awesome. That's usually so cool. Guys, I'm not gonna lie, I didn't actually know that this was gonna happen. Especially since the last time I tried destroying her car and nothing even happened. And now I've just simply stolen it and I've received a text message. Yo, that's so sick! Surely I can't be the only one that doesn't know about this thing. I've never ever in my life seen this message. Yo, I guess you learn something new every day. I mean, this just goes to show how incredible the game is, you know. But the fact that we find out new things after so many years. How? So yeah, moving on to the next experiment, which is gonna be a quick one. We are gonna see what happens if you fall underneath the map. So how am I gonna do this? I'm just gonna basically turn on my mod menu and basically just grab and drop my character underneath the map as you can see. So yeah, this is what's going on in here but what is gonna happen if Trevor falls into this void? It's just nothing below the map, look. So weird, what is gonna happen? Let me know in the comments down below. Let's just drag and drop Trevor underneath the map. Yo, he's got a parachute, that's pretty cool. Yo, this is so cool. I see water above me. Oh. Is that it? Wow, I did not expect that to be honest. It seems that you get teleported back to the surface if you do this. Okay. Okay. That was an interesting one, but I'm not down here. Surely not. You know what? I'm gonna drop myself off at a different location. Let's see. What do we got here? We're gonna drop ourselves under the map inside one of these interiors so I've just picked this big ass building I don't know what this is the maze bank or something like that I'm not sure so I'm just gonna drop off Trevor right about here and see what happens yo I can't even see him yo I couldn't even see him for a while what there's sun underneath what if I activate the parachute what was that okay i just got teleported outside the interior so that was pretty interesting you know so yeah we actually did two awesome experiments today and i really hope you enjoyed the video i think i'm gonna leave it here you know so yeah remember to hit the like button subscribe and turn on those post notifications if you enjoyed the video and i will see you all on the next video peace